welcome back. Let us continue in an attitude of worship as we pray together. Let us pray. Almighty and loving God, we gather today once again, though physically apart, but also sensing that we are joined together by your Holy Spirit. We, we come remembering your ancient promise to send your Spirit upon all people, whether they be young and old, male and female, Jew and Gentile. So we pray, come, Holy Spirit, come. We come remembering the first Pentecost, when your Spirit was given to the apostles, renewing their faith and transforming their lives. We pray, come, Holy Spirit, come. We come on this Pentecost Sunday to be reminded of the constant work of your Spirit, the Spirit that inspires us, that guides us, that challenges us and refines us. We pray, come, Holy Spirit, come. Almighty God, Spirit of truth, come as you promised and reveal to us more of the way of Christ. Come and fill us with a deeper faith and a greater love. Give us the gifts we need so desperately to be able to work for your kingdom. Inspire us with new vision and purpose and breathe your power into our lives. We pray, come, Holy Spirit, come. Almighty and loving God, open our hearts and our minds and our souls to your Spirit. Whoever we may be, and so equip us to live as your people, not just this day, but every day, so that our lives will reflect your glory, that we may be proclaimers of your love. We pray, come, Holy Spirit, come, as we offer this prayer in the name of Jesus our Lord, the giver of the Holy Spirit who has taught us to pray together saying, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who have trespassed against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. Our next song is a song that, that welcomes the, well, the presence of the Holy Spirit into uh, our everyday lives. After which... Eileen Ford, one of our members, will lead us in our prayers for others. <laughs> 